Hey everybody, welcome to Photo Blue, and today I'm going to show you how to use the sharpness adjustment tool in NX Studio by Nikon. Whenever you adjust sharpness, you want to be careful not to go too far because the picture can look unnatural very quickly. Uh, the way a sharpness tool works is it actually increases the contrast around the edges of uh, um, different objects and subjects within the photograph. So we're going to start off and I'm going to show you how to do the basic sharpening and then I'm going to show you how to tweak it somewhat. So to uh, turn the tool on we just kind of click the sharpness checkbox right here and then we have a slider right here. Now you'll notice this bird is out of focus and look particularly around the eyes and the beak. We're going to adjust this slider and as we adjust it over more and more you'll see it starts to look much sharper now. Now also look at this part of the railing here. If I move this back down you'll see the contrast goes down on that part of the railing. So when we, when we move it up the contrast on this railing and even on the tail of this bird where there's some water droplets increases quite a bit. So there's a way to tweak this and it's called an unsharpness mask and the unsharp mask actually uh, can increase contrast around the edges or it controls that. We're going to be using RGB which is all of the colors first and if you look at the intensity here and we're going to exaggerate it and we go all the way over you can see there's a point where we start to get all of this noise in here and it starts to not look good. So really we would bring it back into a point where we're not getting that noise probably. So it would be down pretty low right here. But I'm going to bring it back up so that we can kind of exaggerate some of the things that go on. The next thing we have is the radius. And the radius actually increases uh, I, the uh, thickness of the uh, edge lines that it's adjusting. So if we go all the way over you can see it looks very unnatural. So we're going to bring it back some. Down here is the threshold and the threshold will start to tell it uh, don't pay attention to certain areas. So it starts to uh, bring it back in. So it's a fine tuning adjustment. So those are how the basic adjustments work that you can uh, work with to um, adjust things. And we're going to bring this back down to zero right now, this mask. Now we can actually use a separate color like if something was red for example our subject is red and we want to sharpen just our subject or primarily just our subject we could use a red channel or whatever color channel or channels that are primarily um, uh, affect the subject or what we want sharpen. So in this case I'm going to pick yellow. Now look at the beak of this bird right here when I go and I increase the intensity you can see right there um, it's actually changing the beak. The yellow is actually changing slightly so if we bring it up even more you can see things are happening just to the yellow on this beak or primarily to the yellow on the beak or anything else in the photograph that's yellow. So that's a way that you can adjust things. The other thing you can actually do is you can actually uh, pick more than one color. So you can actually have multiple colors in here and adjust each color, the intensity of each color and the radius and the threshold. Now if you want to get rid of these colors this icon right here will delete the channel that you just did so you can pull them back out and start over again. Uh, typically you would want to uh, use the RGB first unless like I said the subject is a particular color or the thing that you want to sharpen is a particular color you might try uh, using a particular channel or channels to adjust that. So that's how you use the sharpness adjustment tool in uh, NX Studio by Nikon. This has been Photo Blue and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like.